Welcome to the channel. My pack cracking family, Clever Magic Trevor here. I guess our pack cracking family uh, because we are on the CMC, the converted mana cost. No, 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 that's not it. The Clever Magic Community Channel. Yes, that's what we're on. We're on the Clever Magic Community Channel now. Absolutely. Uh, I just wanted to redo, actually this was a, uh, an in, a redone intro uh, for one that I've been talking about. I was trying to get this uh, battle going. I already sent the cards out. You probably already received those, so I apologize because this video hasn't gone live yet. Um, but uh, this was for uh, its battles, basically. And uh, what happened is halfway through this, I got a phone call and it just messed up all my computer and everything. I mean, it just shut it all down and I couldn't get it to back to start up back together. And the whole second part is kind of lost as far as the video footage so i might talk about how uh i'm actually being seen uh, but you can't see me on the second half of the video so uh, anyways i just want to go over that because uh it was kind of one of those things i was like oh boy um well i can't redo this i already sent the cards out and uh, it is what it is so uh without further ado let's get into the battles yeah all right guys as you can see it's battle central up in here up in here First off, we have Michael R. Michael R, who is very well known on the channel, okay? And uh, then we have uh, CMT, also very well known on the channel. And uh, you know, we got four packs, so I have no idea. Just do little leapfroggers and um, I don't know. These are the last four that I put together a long time ago. And so, I mean, pretty much whatever goes. And then these are for the next contestant. Let's go Michael R. first. Here we go. Starting off with Acoria. Fantastic. I do love me some Acoria. Some monsters, some behemoths, some fun, fun, fun. Ooh, man. Okay, so I got a corset. A corset that is about to rotate out, so we'll see. We will see. Let's start with Michael R because, well, even though he's on the channel all the time, he's the guest. He is the guest. Okay, only care about uh, uncommons over 25 cents, rares, and mythics. And foils, of course, foils. Of course, foils. Let's see, I'll have my face, I'll have my face down over there. Yep, okay. Ruinous Ultimatum, probably one of the better ones in my opinion, in my estimation, my humble estimation that uh, I estimate all the time, um, just estimates for all sorts of fun stuff, and giddy up and whatnot. Doesn't make any sense, but you know, you guys don't pay me to make sense, you pay me to talk. Thrashing Brontodon, could have came in handy the other day. Scampering Scorcher, fantastic. And Temple of Silence, I do love my lands, just not temples. Oh well, such, such is life. Let's move on, got a Throne of Peace. Yes, Throne of Eldraine. Back in the day when this was in standard, it still is, looks like we got a foil. It's probably an awesome one, I didn't see it. And it's still on standard. I'm just joking, guys. I'm just totally joking. And Escape to the Wilds, which has kind of made its appearance lately. I wouldn't be surprised if it's sneaking up in value just a little bit. Cauldron's Gift. Mm. I've seen better. I've seen better. Yeah, man, have you guys been seeing Escape to the Wilds? I mean, in standard play quite a bit. You know, it can get some play in other formats, depending on what you're looking to do. But uh, Lucky Clover, also highly played right now. Adversary, uh, we got a giant turtle, and oof, baby, the royal scions. I thought it was a different one. I get confused on 199, and uh, I think it's what 198. I should have looked at the colors. Ooh, a foil emery. Oh, wasn't even paying attention. Pay attention, CMT. You're on screen. Anyways, Oko is uh, one number off of that, I believe. It's been a while. But, uh, a Chimera. Ooh, man, come on, Nyx Lotus. I've been seeing a lot of Nyx Lotus lately, too. Ty 
like the cool. I like that card a lot. I like it a lot. All right, Michael R. Kind of, it's kind of a little bit tough to tell right now. It's a little tough to tell. That's a prophecy. It's a horn beetle and the war. The war. Okay, moving on. Okay, I'm sure this is 2020 also. For a second, I thought it was going to be 2021, but who knows? Oh, there's the eagle. Gets quite a bit of play. Hardcover and shared summons. Not in standard, but you pull that out in other other formats if you know what I mean. And I think you do. And I think you know exactly what I mean. We got another beetle. It's a different beetle than the horn beetle. We'll put them right next to the other one. Magic wand that we'll use the altar for with ah, the maw of flames. You know, it's funny that Ma, he just, uh, I haven't seen him in a while. I haven't seen him. He just kind of disappeared. Off to MH and man, guys. I predicted this. I said MH2 next year. So, I'll take my accolades. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, there's a screech. A shapeshifter. It looks kind of like a spider. Gleaner and deep. Forest Hermit. Not the card we were looking for. It just wasn't it. Okay. Apparently I'm going with 2021 and you're going to go with the Coria. And then, uh, you know what? We'll just see what happens. Here we go. Oh, man. There's a Talisman. Two Talismans. Hierarchy and Conviction. I think the Conviction ones. I think they're both worth like some pennies. Strix and. Okay, so MH didn't deliver for either of us, really. I mean, let's not beat around the bush. It's not like we were in awe of it. Okay, here we go. Commander card. Here we go. Ooh, man, that's not the best commander card. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Garuda. Not bad. It would have been better if it was the full showcase. Ooh, there you go. Zagoth, Triome, Foily. Yes. Okay. And. Ooh, Ketria. King Sissa. And a Burn Lurker that we don't count. Some of these plants over here. Holy moly. What am I doing? The cards just slide around so much, okay? I'm not gonna take responsibility for this one. You guys let me know if you're getting tired of looking at my bald head, okay? Because I'm like this a lot, and you're like, oh man, he really isn't in on top. And I know it, man. I, oh, mountain. It's a good day. It is a good day. Peer into the abyss. Ah, my favorite win con currently. Once again, wish it was showcased, but love the card. Thieves Guild Enforcer. I don't use that much, but I don't play a ton of black that would require that. And I don't typically use a whole lot of spiders either. There's a tutelage I'm not gonna count. And, ooh, simulacra. Is there anything back here? Looked like there was a full. That's what you get. The same, the same, same one. So, okay, let's get on to the next one. It's gonna be a little bit longer. I have no idea who won. Congratulations to whoever won. Hopefully it's me because I do like to win. But I also understand that Michael R, he deserves a win. And the winner, the winner, it's a collector's pack that I will send in the mail. I will send it in the mail. And I need to get Michael R out of here. Back with the people that need shipped. And we have two more. Two more. One versus CMT. And this 
This, my friends, is just an age, which I have a story about in a second. But we are going to do this battle first. Okay? We're gonna battle it like it's 1985. Oh yeah, here we go. Justin Stevens. Oh, Justin S. That's what I meant. Oh, I just crushed that garbage. You guys couldn't see it, but you could hear it. I know. Boom. Just crushing. Ooh, I like your start better. Ooh, Theros. Ooh, man. Oh. Okay, giddy up. Let's get going on this, all right? Justin S. Okay. Alrighty. I don't think he's anything right now. Bonder. That might be over a quarter. Still played quite a bit. And oh gosh. Not the best. Not the worst. Not the best, not the worst. I mean, pretty much if you don't get a Titan in here or some sort of nice mythic in a uh, Theros box, you're not writing home to the girlfriend about, okay? Or mama, daddy, any of the sorts. Chimera, of course. That's some velocity that we have to escape, but that was by design to shatter the sky. I do love shatter the sky. Once again, I don't play a ton of white, but when I do, I try to make sure it has a shatter the sky in. Or something like that. Okay, so as you can see by the set symbol right here, we're in throne. A wonderful throne, shambling suit. Turn you into a pumpkin, Justin. Boom, with a fable passage, man. Man, a while ago, that would have been a pretty, 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 pretty penny. Okay, so we're back on, on Theros, and I got a second Theros. How does that happen? Justin's cheating. Ooh, I wonder if that foul mire. Okay. second here. Can I put my stuff over here? I'm confused on what's going on. Where did I put my... What the heck is going on here? So you had your three. And then you had your three. I should just have my three. Yeah. This is my pack, right? Right? I'm so confused. Okay, that is correct. That is correct. So I have a throne. This is my throne. Holy Toledo. Talk about the confusion. Dance of the Mance, which I have seen a lot lately. It's actually a pretty darn good card. I don't know what the deal is. I don't know what the deal is. I always thought it was kind of crap, but it's coming back in the standard. Anybody playing? Anybody playing arena? They know that. They know that. Got a Chimera. Presence and whoa, Strider. It feels like we got a foil though. Uncommon Daxos. It makes me curious with those constellations. I mean, they just, they didn't hold value. There's too many of those dang Daxoses. It's a great card. Falling Stars. Yeah, too many of them. Rare, Labyrinth of Scophus. I prefer your Fable Passage. We both got an uncommon foil. What are the stinking odds? Okay, so Magic 2020 Quartz set. About to rotate out. It's actually it's kind of scary. I love this set. I've been talking about this set forever. And you can go through the comments and see how much this stuff is used. Get another Altar, Bark Ride Troll, and Rotting Registrar. Great card. Great, great, great card. Not a ton of value, which is pretty much all we're after when we're battling. But, but it's still nice to get good cards, right? Stormkin. That's a noxious grass. Shifting Ceratops. Fantastic card. And a common Inquisitor. Inquisitor. Okay, let's try to make these Modern Horizons a bit better than we did with uh, Michael. Seems 
sometimes it's just out of your control. It's a wing shards. Yeah, it's very tranquil. That thicket there. Yeah, you might want to scale up to a fiery islet. That's a great draw. Great, great, great draw. In fact, everybody knows I love my red and, and blue. Is it? Is it? Is it a good card? Is it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And of course, because I pulled a slivers, there it is. We got a soul herder. Do you love that art? I've mentioned it many times. And Hall of Helioids Generosity. Can't remember. Ah, this isn't the expensive haul, is it? I think it's the other hauls. I think it is. I think it is. Ooh. Vesper Lark. Folio. Folio. Ooh, this time I get the Ikoria. And the other person, which happens to be Justin, gets 2021. That was quite the pause. Quite the pause. Boom. Ooh, Stormwing Entity. That's a great card, though. Oh, Stormwing Entity. That's a great card, though. Okay, that's all right. Yep. Meep, meep. Ooh, look like there was something under right there. I might have missed it. Man, I don't know how many times we're going to pull this card. Apparently, many, 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 many times. Ooh, another rare. Ooh, a box topper. Scavenging ooze. Very, very played. Very highly played. I got to get something good. Let's say as of right now, he's wiping the floor. Wiping the floor. Okay. Can we commander it up with a decent card for once? It's a rare this time. Okay. It's a giant flying mammal. Fishy thingy. Bonders Enclaves. A great card, just not the value we're looking for. Sky Cat Sovereign. Full box stopper. Stupid things ringing, and now it's not going to match with my thing. Oh, gosh. Okay. Dirge Bat. Dorat Huntsman. I think you took it to me. I think you did. That's just the way things go. Oh, did I hit? Did I hit record? Okay, so look. Um, sorry for the confusion on getting this one going. Stupid phone calls. I mean, you saw me messing with my phone. It's like, come on, people. I'm trying to film a video here. I mean, do you even care what I do on my free time? Do you even care? That's that's what I want to tell people. Now, this is Justin S. We are leaving his stuff there. And I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why right now. Right now. That is because he's my next contestant. Round two. That's right. Point. He is my next contestant. Now, Justin spent a lot of money. He bought two. He bought one versus a sub and one versus me. But I wanted both versus me. I wanted you twice. And the reason being, I kind of had some stuff going on. I was like, you know what? I'm going to shift some of these subs back to me um, so I can battle you. So this one is going to be for a separate collector's pack. But this one also is going to be a little bit different. I told you I ran out of the standard four that I sold. And so these ones are actually different. The value is definitely there. Okay. The value is definitely there. And we'll take a look and show you why. Okay. Um, oh man. So here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ikoria. Standard. Heartless Act, that's a fantastic card. Lord Dracus, that's a card, beautiful color. Ah, Vadrock. Okay. Core 2021. Let's uh, go ahead and pull a Mythic or something. That'd be fantastic. I'd like that very much. Thank you very much. Ooh, okay. This is backwards. Okay. Okay, here we go. Okay. Ooh, 
Ooh, village, right? See, that should be worth... I mean, that should be an uncommon. If you're going to have a sacrifice deck, the amount of people that use village rides, I mean, come on, it's a common. Okay. Let's animate that fairy. The puppet. Ooh, the witch's oven. Not as used quite a bit. But, man, mono green is being used like crazy in Yorvo. It's kind of the king of modern green right now. It's, it always was, really. Just mono green wasn't very powerful before. Tefiri really, uh, the ban on Tefiri really changed things up. We got some cryptic caves. We got scuttlebutt. I mean, mutt. Rare. Golos. That's a great rare, though. And a mind rot. And a mind rot. Okay, see? So now I got a gate crash. Happens to be one of my favorite sets. And he's got a guild. Changing, changing things up out of standard. Well, this one's not technically. It will be shortly. But my gate crash is definitely out of standard. Rock charger. Ooh, stupid thought eraser. Ooh. Discordant. Trust Danny. Discordant. First mythic we've kind of pulled, really. All right? Man. Okay, look. It's all about the Shocklands. So, if I could pull a Shockland, I'd be a happy man. If I can't, I'm still a happy man. Just not going to be happy, as happy with the pull, at least. Because I'll still always be super happy. Here we go. Ooh, Mythic. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. It doesn't show it in Gate Crush. Fire Main Avenger. Gosh, I remember this card. That was a long time ago. And a Foily Mountain. They know to give me the mountains. They know. They know. They know. They know. Okay. I love Gate Crush. I can open Gate Crush over and over and over. I'd, I'd probably open about four or five boxes on this channel already because I do love it and it's still relatively inexpensive relatively inexpensive 100 bucks okay that's a lonely sandbar it's a good card though all that cycling scuttling s sliver and prismatic vista dang dude dang spanking me Nicely done, Justin. Nicely done. I'm not mad at all. I mean, we're not friends anymore, but I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Land of War Tribe. Ooh, let's pillage right now. Oh, man. I got a Eula on the last one. It was just a different Eula. A Eula card. Come on, man. Look at this. Mysteries. Oh, two of them. Two of them. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We do's in this. We do's in. We do's in. Listen. It's kind of hard not to count some of these. With these ones, we're going to go straight back. Not count any of the, uh, the colored cards because, you know, they got two of each card. And then we'll go through this. Anything over a quarter on the last five, okay? Okay, yeah, yeah. That's a refuge. Ooh, path razor of Olamog. Ooh, debtors now. And flame can harbor here. Nah, 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 nah. This is a brand new box of mystery, so I mean anything goes in this. And the thing is, somebody pulls a crypt, game over. Game over. Okay. Get past the first 10 cards. Got a gargoyle. I love that art. Whisper Silk Cloak. Magus of the Moat. Alicia. Who smiles at death. She always smiles at death. And a knight. Not terrible. Not what I was looking for. I mean, honestly, 
It's such a great set. I'm not even gonna look at this stuff because there might be some jewels in there for you that you might be happy about. Hope Justin's all right with me doing this. Man, amorphous. As much as this card's been reprinted, it's just such a great card. Jin of Wishes. And the Script Ranger. Okay, you know what? I don't know what the Jin of Wishes is. I haven't pulled it very much. I have no idea what the cost is right now. Probably not great. I don't know. Let's get past the first 10. Which can be some good stuff. Can be. Burnished Heart. Ooh, Phantom Centaur. Mythic, here we go. Star of Extinction. Uh, I used to love this. My land destruction deck just... So destroy target land. Star of Extinction deals 20 damage to each creature and each planeswalker. Ouchie, ouchie. And Hornet Sting. I, I don't like Hornet Stings. So there you have it. Uh, I'm guessing he won. I have no idea what some of those are worth right now because I don't know what they're worth in the mystery. But we are going to find out. He did get some great pulls at Prismatic Vista. And I think that might be... Is that the, one of them repaired in... Uh, no, Cavernous Souls is one of them. Uh, but in uh, Zendikar Rising coming up. Anyways, you guys let me know. Thank you so much to everybody that competed against me. Thank you, thank you. Well, per usual, I don't know exactly who won, but I have an idea. Uh, yeah, man, holy crud. Battles are just... Uh, I don't know. I love them so much, but uh, sometimes I get the feeling they don't love me. They don't love me. I don't know. Uh, it is what it is. It's all about the fun. I, I'm I'm kind of like how you guys are winning on my channel, which is streaky. I'll win a bunch and everybody's like, wow, you never lose. And I'm like, yeah, until I start to lose and then I never win. It is what it is. So super fun. Uh, congratulations to the winners. Regardless, man. And uh, you know what? You, it's time to sign off so you guys know what to do make sure you subscribe like the video uh you know what uh, make sure you just comment the cards you want i i have been trying to get people things that they did comment not always but uh because most of it's random randomized but it is nice to know what you guys uh, thought you might want to win off the stuff that i pulled for myself so anyways we'll catch you on the next video